So, hello everyone, back after three years at the Eco Summit. And what happened since then? The renewable energies and the electromobility is growing together, and that's exactly where Adaptive City Mobility is active. In my name is Paul Leibold, I'm the founder of Adaptive City Mobility, short ACM. Our objective is to develop a competitive and emission free e mobility system for cities. In 2015, we were awarded by the German government as one of seven uh, e-mobility lighthouse projects. And beside the honor, it's a big or huge expectation from the government. And the reasons are that we want to reduce the total cost of ownership in the taxi business up to 12,000 euro. And we want to extremely reduce the CO2 emission uh, up to zero CO2 coming from seven, seven tons a year. So we are, meanwhile, 10 partners with the support of the Federal Ministry of Economic Affairs and Energy. And these charts look quite complicated, but the message is simple. We now develop the prototype system, and the next step is the industrialization, where we need the next big financing so investors feel invited. What's the problem we solve? Uh, Private-owned combustion engine cars in the inner city cause huge problems on behalf of health, environment, and quality of life. And ladies and gentlemen, we can't continue like this. We have to stop. We need to change. We can't give over a world, a climate, and cities like we have today to our children. And therefore, we need a general city solution. And we are convinced that these are e-fleets, shared e-fleets, and the downsizing of the vehicles instead of driving around with your private SUV in the inner city. Big cities already started to prohibit these dirty and private vehicles. They will replace them through e-fleet systems, which is always an electric vehicle, an energy solution, and the intelligent connectivity. So uh, city operators will the, uh, oper uh, finance and uh, operate these fleets in different applications, and citizens and corporates will share these e-fleets uh, in different applications like e-taxi, e-sharing, e-logistic, and to e-tourism. As a result, less vehicle, intelligently networked with 24-7 utilization, uh, reduce massively the traffic density. So ACM has three main innovations. Uh, it's a e -sh uh, share, uh, shared e-fleet solution, a downsized solution, and the innovation one is our ultra-lightweight vehicle. The innovation two is a manual battery swapping system beside the possibility to, change, to charge by cable. And innovation three is the intelligent connectivity of all entities. And in this way, we want to create 5 to 15% more profit in the value chain than competitors by a radical cost reduction and creation of new turnovers. Real-time data of all entities are the basis of the radical new business model, and the real-time data will help us to increase the utilization and the efficiency. We will get commissions for the right reservation, the payment process, digital advertisement, energy sales, and mobility services. So we position ourselves in a worldwide, fast-growing market in Asia, known as Riksha and Tuk Tuk in Europe as Quad and Renault Twissy. There we have a development advantage of two to three years, according to fir big first-tier supplier. And uh, ACM is not getting another car manufacturer. We outsource this to production partners. We are a mobility provider. And to give you an idea about the market potential in China for 2020, are already one million pieces of, uh, two million pieces are forecasted. So the business model is a two-side revenue stream. We get commissions for selling the whole system to operators in cities, and there we focus on a few big cities. And we additionally get variable charges over the years for mobility services date, uh, based on real-time data, like I mentioned, right reservation, payment, energy sales, and so on. So the, uh, our innovation one, the lightweight vehicle, which you can see next, in the next room, is the city e-taxi. 
which weighs only 550 kilograms, including battery weight. We presented it this year in Munich and also at the Sebit and Hannover. The orange frame is a carbon fiber safety cell, which weighs only 40 kilograms. Around this cell, we adapt all the other parts. It's a three-seater. And at the Sebit, we presented the first time our manual battery swapping system with this solution. We solved the problem of charging time and also of uh, the limited range. And we have two trays on each side with four battery packs uh, weighing each 10 kilograms, which are easy to handle and to change. And from the back, you see our digital advertisement panel with e-ink technology. Meanwhile, there are such size, uh, colorful panels on the market, so we can steer a digital advertisement to a complete fleet. And from the back, it's more a van because you can easily click out each single back seat and put a Euro palette inside of the vehicle and use the same vehicle in the city logistic. So on the same platform, we develop variations like e-van and e-pickup. And that means for us, we have many different applications with the same platform. Our innovation too is the energy system, the manual battery swapping and energy storage. Imagine you drive this vehicle to your home or your office building, open the tray, put out the battery, click it in the trolley, drive the trolley in the battery box, which is connected to your uh, solar panel where you produce your own renewable energy, store it in the box, use it in the house or in the uh, electric vehicle. In this way, you create zero CO2 emissions and we just were in India, and the Indian government pronounced their new, announced their new uh, e-mobility strategy, which is very similar to the ACM system, and there's a huge potential for our target systems like this. So the Innovation 3 is a real-time networking software, uh, and with the networking software, we have an operator platform where we have a, con a central uh, control dashboard, where all the real-time data are connected and operators steer a whole fleet uh, with the system and we have the data of the vehicles, of the navigation, of the battery system, of the different uh, uh, user interfaces, of the digital uh, advertisement of the, uh, at the back of the vehicle and uh, end-user app. So the last months we got huge me uh, media coverage, positive reports about our projects and yeah, ladies and gentlemen, uh, it's time to change. Uh, I want to invite you to change, uh, share e-fleets in the city and help to downsize uh, vehicles. Thank you very much.